Hey guys, I'm gonna do another birthday video later. Um, but I'm always very reflective the night before my birthday, just about the life I've had, the year, um, things I've gone through, um, perseverance, you know, the good, the ups, the downs, things like that. I have a lot to be grateful for, but you know, I always, um, reminisce, well, not reminisce, but talk about the night before I was born, um, that I almost wasn't here. Um, my biological father, um, kind of sparked my early birth in the world. I think I was almost it was two and a half months early, um, because she had, my mom was pushed by him over some argument, I don't know what, doesn't really matter, um, she fell backwards and it triggered early labor. I did not go down like a regular baby should. You know, when you're ready to give birth, they lower, and I was not ready to be born. Um, he left, and my mom was in labor um, from 8 a.m. the night before all the way till, I think, 4 in the morning. Um, I is when she finally got to the hospital. Um, and I don't remember when she said I was born because um, what happened was she was in labor. He had left um, because he was upset. Came back at four in the morning and realized she was still in pain. Um, she went to the hospital. He went to work. She spiked a fever. I spiked a fever and all sorts of other things. Um, we were overseas at the time. Um, and she had to be put under anesthesia, an emergency C-section. Uh, and when she awoke, you know, most people get that, you know, beautiful baby in their arms and the loving skin-to-skin -skin contact, um, she woke up in the hospital, um, with a Filipino nurse, uh, slapping her on the face gently to wake her up, saying, wake up, your baby is going to die. So, right from the second she knew I was born, she had worry in her system um and they gave me 24 hours to live 48 72 a week a month um and it wasn't nothing was really known about my condition um but they said you know what we don't know if this baby is going to live they labeled throw your thrive and we went back to the states um close to where my grandparents are and stuff so um so i mean i've been kind of kicked ever since the day i was born or the the day prior but through a whole bunch of things um i managed to beat the odds and through illnesses and surgeries and you know i didn't get covid thank goodness um you know i have a lot to be very grateful for um people in my life who have supported me 
have gotten to me through not only this year, but every other year. Um, so, like I said, it doesn't matter how you start out. It matters how you keep going. And what you do with the life you have. No matter what it looks like. Um, I didn't know if I was going to do this live or, or do a video. I started live and then I got emotional and then I cut it off and yeah, no. So now you know a little bit of something about me. Um, I'd also uh, say I, I might do another live tonight. Um, you know, maybe have a cupcake with you guys, celebrate my birthday. Um, so I'm gonna end this before it gets too late. Um, thanks guys for listening.